top five Pedro Pascal work projects? You could, man. I man, I love Pedro. That'd be fly. That'd be good. <laughs> let's, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> Sean, did you watch what? the last of us? I have not started that yet. No. Okay. I haven't either. It's it's uh it just finished, so we're finishing up uh we're finishing up Animal Kingdom season six on Amazon Prime, and then we're gonna probably jump <laughs> into The Last of Us. <coughs> oh, very good TV show if you haven't watched it yet. Animal Kingdom. Have you guys even heard of it? I've heard of it. I have not watched it yet. It. So did have either of you watched Peaky Blinders? Nope. The Peaky okay. fucking blinders. Another great, probably a top five for me, but one of the, one of the main actors on there is uh, the main actor for uh, Animal Kingdom. Anyways, it's about uh, this family um, in San Diego, Oceanside area, um, in California, uh, and they uh, uh, they're thieves. They go for a living, so they have this really nice house. The mom like uh, controls all of it. She's got one, two. Three, three or f- yeah, four kids, um, and then Jay, uh, the guy from Peaky Blinders, um, he gets it's his grandmother and his uncles. His mom dies of an overdose, and then gets brought into the family drama. And I mean, it it's gets to the point sometimes where <clears throat> I'm watching it, and then I'll go and look out the windows to make sure the cops aren't coming for me. It's like that's just the way it makes me feel. It gets you so drawn in and wrapped up, like you think you're getting in trouble while watching this shit. It, it's it, it's a hook, line, and sinker of a show. Interesting. John, for your distinction, I gotta know, because we talked about the um, unbearable weight. Of massive the, talent, the, the, of, yeah the the unbearable weight of massive talent uh, with incredibly Nick Cage, massive talent? incredibly massive talent. Yes, uh, with Nick Cage, Pedro Pascal. You you said decent. I t- I sent you guys a snap. You showed you I was watching it. You go decent. What does decent mean to you? Because decent is usually like mediocre to subpar. Decent was it was pretty good, but. I'm probably not going to rewatch it again for a long, long time. Yeah, <laughs> I I don't usually typically rewatch movies, so I'd be in the same boat. Like I'm not going to watch it again, maybe ever, but because I don't rewatch movies. But I thought it was, I thought why, it was really. Why good. don't you rewatch movies though? Do you not have like good movies that are like, oh, this is like one of my favorites of all time? No, um, like I I have like movies that i absolutely love i'm just not a fan of like re-watching things i don't even really re-watch tv shows like if i re rewatch a tv show it's because my wife hasn't seen it and i think it's good and i haven't watched it in like 10 years or more and then i'll re-watch it or whatever but it's not i'm just not a big re-watcher of things you gotta re-watch stuff to make sure it all holds up though like that's the problem is a lot of stuff doesn't still hold up. And if you rewatch it and it doesn't hold up, then it just ruins the memory that you hold of that movie at the time that you watched it. Hmm. I don't think so, man. I enjoy rewatching stuff a lot. I rewatch the... a simpler time sometimes. <laughs> I watched Bullet Train like fucking twenty five yeah. times now, bro. <laughs> like I, I rewatched the Harry Potter series because I hadn't finished it. I missed like the last. I didn't watch like the last three or four until well after the last one came out like, by like five years, um, <clears throat> and like the, the first couple didn't hold up to me. But also, I watched them the last when I was a kid, and it was like those were super magical and memorable. And so it kind of ruined the memory that I had of them from when I first watched. Wait, should I be muting myself while I cough? Like at this time, like is it is this pod yeah, pod yeah, stuff? I mean, yeah, I mean we're recording. It did say 
We're recording, recording, but I mean, we're recording. You're you're fine. You're fine, Sean. Write that down. You're fine. No, no, no. Tybo's the fine recorder now. Oh, why? That's his one. You said you were going to do it. You you asked for it. You did ask for it. (laughs) I asked for it. And I mean, it only really counts if it goes on the pod, right? I don't think we've decided if we actually started yet. Hmm. See, mm. this is where this is where I'm completely like in the dark on this shit. Like, I <laughs> I don't know how it's working. Okay, I feel like we just need to get into like a simple topic, like this, like we're going about, and we're just gonna start somewhere in there. I'm gonna just cut it in at some where at that point, and then other than that, somebody's gonna start talking about football, and we're going off from there. So did we? Are we? Have we not started? <laughs> we kind of did, but Sean. we just broke it down. All right, there. All right Sean. You fuck. I mean, Tybo was confused again, so let's help the man out. Don't put him into that bad situation again. Please put him in the bad situation. It's the best I mean, part about it. Do you want that, or do you want a lot of coughs on the pod? I want him to be fine. We need money in the pot. I am Wait. fine. I am recording it. <laughs> Behind the scenes. Do you guys honestly rewatch a lot of the stuff that, that you've watched before? Yeah. Um, to be 100% honest, like it takes a lot for me to rewatch something, but like I've watched Kill Bill many times. I've watched uh, movies like Pineapple Express many times, Step Brothers. Like, when I was in middle school and high school, yes, I watched a lot of the same shit over and over. I'm in that. I guess I'm in that small the minority because I'm the movie that departed. Know. Whenever it came on TV, I was usually watching it. Like that was more when I was rewatching shit a lot. Now it takes a. It takes like in my adult life, it takes a lot for me to rewatch a show or a, a movie. Yeah, I probably. I mean, as kids, we always rewatch because it's easy. For our parents, but I don't know. I guess I'm in that minority that because I I don't know too many people. All that the jackasses I've don't rewatch countless times. Are there not like movies or TV shows you see while you're scrolling through the TV guide or something? Like, oh yeah, that's good. I don't. I don't think either. But well, Ty Bob, you has you still have YouTube TV? I guess so. You scroll. I've got YouTube something. TV, but I yeah, mean, that's what I, I don't. Do too, but... I don't typically scroll to like have stuff in the background. If I'm going to throw something in the background, it's like music. How much is my coughing fund? The dollar. It's a major fund. Doll hair. You know? You know. I lost my train of thought. You know who knows? Bo knows. Bo knows. Lex and Honest Tybo? Ty Bo does not know. He didn't know when we started. Neither did you. You know exactly when we started. Neither did Sean I. Tried to t- Next. <laughs> Sean tried to tell me that we didn't. <clears throat> That's yet to be determined. <laughs> I'll fucking tell you what's yet to be determined. Motherfucker. Um... <laughs> Uh, the Oscars I think happened I don't pay attention to award shows but I guess the Oscars happened early this week or was it last week I would assume it would have been on a Sunday no when award shows usually happen it's like when every award show happens I do know that nobody got uh, nobody got slapped though not this year which at this point you know What's really happening if nobody's getting slapped? Like, that's why people. If you want, if you want ratings, like you better have something happen. You gotta have drama. Did you guys go back and we covered this in last week's pod? But did you guys go back and watch the Chris Rock special at all? No, no, (laughs) good. I didn't either. I did catch the clip of uh, of his. I watched uh, it for thirty minutes and turned it off. I was mad at it. Like it was bad. Is the topic he chose is just like it's kind of beaten like a dead horse nowadays. Like, uh, Burt Kreischer's new special is on Netflix, though. I haven't watched that one yet, but 
It is on. I there. will watch that, and if he squeals the whole time, I'm going to turn it off. <laughs> <laughs> I will say, I did go to a comedy show between last time we talked and now. Yeah. Board teacher comedy tour. It was on a Sunday. It was on a Sunday. Surprisingly. Got free tickets, man. Wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. Sean had a terrible time. No, I had a great time. Got a few drinks in me. Just laughing. What else did you get in you? Some uh, street tacos. Okay. Street tacos in Columbia, Missouri? Yeah. Hmm? At the comedy place? No. Oh. Free tacos in Columbia, Missouri cannot be good for your stomach. The tacos were free? Tacos were not free. Street tacos, not yeah. free tacos. Yeah. No, I said street tacos. Uh, I I heard you say free tacos. This, this guy. Street tacos in Columbia, Missouri cannot be good for your stomach. Columbia has some good restaurants. Yeah. He's talking like he's been to Columbia a lot. I've been to Columbia many times. He doesn't know shit about Columbia. It's like saying the food in the Ozarks is good, too. And it's like, no. Tell you what, dude, that fried crappie down there ain't beat it. (laughs) <laughs> the meth too actually I don't think you want to be eating fish out of Lake of the Ozarks anymore no. probably not I did see from the Oscars though uh, <laughs> everything everywhere all at once won a lot of awards still and haven't watched it that is one of my favorite movies now it's confusing That's good. I have rewatched that like three or four times at least where can I watch how, it for free? How can you do that? I bought it on Prime Video. How can you watch everything everywhere all at once? I don't know, man. It's just everywhere. That They made the movie title on purpose like that, and I think that's frustrating. It is, but... You're literally watching everything everywhere all at once. It really uh, bottles your mind. Yeah, uh, uh, there is... A- <laughs> the movie title that just spinning around in there <laughs> confuses me a lot. It, <laughs> the uh, the Tom Cruise that Tom Cruise movie was it? It came out as Oblivion, Tropic Thunder, That's Edge a, of Tomorrow. Very good oh. movie. <laughs> well, it's now the Edge of Tomorrow. When it came out, it was Oblivion. Wasn't How it was Oblivion, that? Edge of Tomorrow? Yeah, and now they've just changed it to Edge of Tomorrow. Like they went in and they changed everything after it was released for a few years, and then they just changed it to Edge of Tomorrow, and now they then they came out with the sequel. Because Oblivion was on the Edge of Tomorrow, and then Tomorrow happened, so there's no more Oblivion. So no, no, no. Right. I'm saying Sean. in the original show, Sean, the original movie right. was called Oblivion. They went in and took the name Oblivion out of the original movie. Yeah, Be- because. Oblivion was on the edge of tomorrow. I think that one makes perfect sense. You're mind bottling me now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not beat that joke to death, guys. Okay. Ow. Do you have Ooh, a grievance ow. about that? Lord. I'm not even going to address <laughs> that. Okay. Well, is that is that word now gone as well? That word has been gone forever. For that me. word, yeah. You you don't remember the episode that you just word vomited? Oh, no, I I I remember it. Grievances and dying. You know, you know. I can't help that one. You know. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really hard one to like work out of the vocabulary. I know. Yes. <laughs> you know too.